Hey guys, I'm Kord, welcome back to Baldur's Gate 2 and Austin Edition. In the last episode we took care of Abbot Sigil, the uh, Dragonborn Bald Spawn, and we picked up a... Uh... It's a fine day for fireballs. Yeah, Nera. We picked up a uh, scale from his body, which I for some reason couldn't craft from Cespinar, but I managed to fix it by um, placing that bugged piece of shadow scale on the ground, and that made uh, Cespinar able to craft this. 90% electrical resistance! Yay! I'm gonna keep that. Just in case I run into any more... Well, Give electrical resistance rest. people. <laughs> I'm waiting if it must and we're back here in Amkifrand, where we're gonna try to confront Balthasar for being a bald spawn and trying to... Um... Oh, hello. It's him! Destroy him in the name of all that is righteous! No! Victory, unclear. Destruction? I probably shouldn't have come to uh, the main gate. Oh no, someone did a quivering palm. Who was it? The guard captain. Everyone go for him. Good. Quivering palm, if you don't remember, is the um, insta-kill. Monk ability. Oh no, she did something. Can't have that. Are you gonna keep yeah. coming? I think they're gonna keep coming. Let's run off. Death comes for you. Feel its icy Let's do breath. This quick quivering and palm, pain. more quivering palms. Die. Let's run in here. No, no, don't attack Nira. That is bad. That is very you bad. Gather your party before run into the forth. smuggler's hideout. That's where I'm gonna meet uh, him anyway, I think. Yes. Right. Speak your mind if you must. Why, hello again, Cards. I have been waiting for you. Um, I was told to find you. So why are the, all these hostile? Pretty much. I must be cursed to keep running into you. Ah, yes, yes. I suppose we could rehash our differences. Were I mind to. But surrounded by my slaughtered old comrades as I am, I'm hardly in the mood. I figured you'd be coming back to Amkefran soon enough. And so I waited for you. I have a proposition if you're interested. You betrayed me constantly, even with those guards. Why should I trust you? I've done what I've had to in the past. I may owe you for my f unfortunate rudeness, perhaps. But overall, you and I are pretty even, Cards. What do you mean, even? You don't think I had much of a choice with all that business in Spellhold, did you? And for all my troubles, for bringing you to the island, I ended up losing my best ship. And then there's the business of my poor men here. If it weren't for you and all those other bald spawn, my little smuggling business here could have continued quietly as it was. As it is, I've lost nearly all of my investment, and I'm not very happy about it. What do you mean? Why are you blaming me for all this? Did I say that? But you are involved in it, at least indirectly, whether you had any malicious intent or not. I certainly don't harbor, harbor any ill will towards you, after all. We could argue about who's done what to whom all day, or maybe less, as I imagine my being chopped into bits might make your argument a little more effective than mine. Regardless, hear me out first. I blame Balthasar, if anything. He's made my life nothing short of difficult, and now he's gone and curtailed me completely, and harmed some perfectly innocent people. He's got to pay for that. As I understand it, you've got to get inside the monastery, and I've got a couple of ideas which might enable you to do that. Are you interested? I'll listen to you. Now, I know you were more reasonable than you seemed. Alright then. The best way I can think of to get inside the monastery is through disguise. My men scavenged a few uniforms. It's enough for you and me to bluff our way past the gate guards. I need to go with you, naturally. I've done this before, and I know the proper codes to tell them. Why would you wanna come with me? I get to exact revenge on Balthasar. I'm a man with a reputation to uphold, after all. I can't allow slights like this to pass, you know. And besides, I suppose I owe you one. Hmm. Let's do it. Alright then. Give me a few moments to prepare. Come and talk to me again once you're ready to go, alright? Alright, yeah. I think we're gonna maybe face some um, 
opposition when yes. we do this, so we might as well do a bit of buffing. What can I do? Because why the heck not? Hmm. I'm good to go. That's probably I best left to Speak me. your mind if you must. Are you ready to go then? I've got the uniforms ready. Let's go. Would I steer you wrong, Cart? Um, yes, you would in a heartbeat. But I think he, I can trust you on this. You want revenge. The ball spawn taint must be cleansed, brother. With the mercy of the gods, it shall be so, brother. So that was the code. Now let's get in there. Nice! We're in! Uh oh. Ah, Samon, you have done well, delivering the ball spawn as you promised. I assume they have been drugged. We do not want any trouble after all. Samon! You bastard! I brought him, but he may be more than you can handle. I drugged this one once before. I owe him one. Yes! Samon! You're redeemed. I knew Balthazar was a fool to trust you, Samon. Nice! Good one. We're even. Die! Now let's take care I'm of these still. two before we go for the mages. Actually, let's go for the mages. No, 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 no. You shall not do that. And you shall not do that. You help out. With the fighters. Oh, no one had their, their scripts on. That's bad. Uh-oh. Time stop. What are you gonna do? I'm not a fan that uh, while time stop, my turns keep running. So my buffs can run out like they just did. That is bad. What? Now the other mage got a time stop off. What the hell? This light. Still, it burns me. That is bad. But I think I can deal with it. I... Some symbols. I hope I can resist them. We have the resist fear on. Yes, that worked. Now what do we have? I'm ready. You help out over there. One of the uh, mages are down. Ow. Don't hurt me. Baby, don't hurt me. No more. Oh no, there are more. Hexat, switch back to your bow. And take the back row. Good. Did you have anything of worth? No. No. Let's go in here. You must gather your party before venturing. I don't want to go through the front door. Balthazar's compound may be difficult to infiltrate. I will need to find a way to get inside. Perhaps someone around the settlement will be able to help me. Oh, that's the f previous one. I have managed to get inside Balthazar's compound. All that remains is to confront this last ball spawn. And then, and then I don't know. What will happen when I am the only ball spawn left? And god damn it, I got fatigued. I can't rest here. Am I gonna have to do this without while being fatigued? Yeah, Why did I get fatigued anyway? Uh oh. I walked into it. Your presence here shows me how foolish I have been in gathering my army of mercenaries. I truly regret my wasted efforts at the expense of Amcatherine's citizens. I know your secret, Balthazar! You were working with Abbasigal and Sendai! I suppose it may have appeared as such, though in truth I have plotted their destruction ever since Malisan recruited me into the Five. What do you mean? I knew I couldn't trust Malisan! Damn it! Are you saying Malisan is the leader of the Five? Melisan recognized the taint of Baal within me, just as she recognized it in Sendai, Abazagal and the others, just as she recognized it in you. She lured me with promises of power and glory, but I followed her for a different reason. Only by joining the Five could I discover who the others were and plot their demise. So you used me to betray the other Baal spawn for your own goals? I wish I could take the credit for this brilliant ruse, but it seems I was not the only member of the Five who plotted the downfall of the others. 
Melisande is the puppet master pulling your strings in this staged production. I have merely tried to stay out of your path for as long as possible, anxious to see if you would prevail. Why would Melisande have gathered the five only to plot their destruction? It matters not. In the end, both Melisande and I have what we want. The other members of the five are dead, though she and I remain at odds. Huh. And now I suppose you plan to kill me, so you can re resurrect Ball all by yourself. Oh no, I have no such designs. Ball's taint is an evil blight upon the world. I have no intention of bringing the Lord of Murder back into existence. My plan is much more altruistic. I have vowed to exterminate all the Ball's children. Forever wiping the realms clean of his tainted existence. You have merely helped me in my goal. That sounds like a good thing, doesn't it? But I'm also good. I've been doing the same thing. What happens to you in this plan? Once I'm certain I'm the last, once I know there are no others, I will perform a ritual suicide. Ball's evil will die with me, but first I must end your evil existence. Well, I will not be a party of that. I'm not evil. I'm a force of good and justice. People sing the praises of your name card. You strive to walk the path of virtue. But your intentions are meaningless compared to the consequences of your existence. How many bodies have you left in your wake? Hundreds? Thousands? Sarah Douche is a smoking waste. How many other cities and towns have you brought destruction raining down upon? And how many corpses have you left behind, Balthasar? I am much the same, card. Our mere presence brings death. It is inevitable. It is our destiny. We are not to blame. We are slaves to our father's tainted blood. And as your power grows, so shall the ruin sown in your passing. Kingdoms will fall, and the rivers of Faerun will run with blood. You condemn me based on my possible future? That is not justice. Further conversation is pointless. I have a task which I must complete. Your death is a necessity, Ballspawn. Well, shit, I think it's on. Are you gonna turn hostile? No? No? Yes. Well, I guess I'll uh, your back. pop one of these down then. Did I get the right one? No, I did not. Put that over there. One, very good. Give me some direction. That's the and put manage. that over there. I'm I hope waiting. you're not bugged. Someone's getting I'm willing. Your presence surprise. here shows me how foolish I have been in well. gathering my army of mercenaries. <sighs> I truly regret my wasted efforts at Melisande. Bugs. Me with promises of power and glory. Melisande is the Let's try that again. Master, pulling your strings in this staged production. I Once I'm certain I'm the last. How many bodies have you left in your wake? And as your power grows, so shall further conversation is pointless. I have a task which I must... Well, complete. I guess we're doing this the old-fashioned way. Boss. Let's go! Hold still, curse you! Um, hello. Well, this is no fun. I'm gonna try to reload and see if that helps. Alright, I think I fixed the problem. We have Balthasar becoming hostile now. And I think we're gonna go for him because he's probably the biggest threat in here. And he probably has some... Uh, Interesting abilities like the other ball spawn. You try to go keep them busy. Give me some you try to go, go keep it. them busy. Mm. And you use the spell trigger I've set up to lower his resistances. Because he's a uh, monk which has high magic resistance. Can't have that. Let's do this quick and pain. Nice. And the uh, chaos I uh, also got on him afflicted the monk. That's great. Nira. Try to cast Improved Alacrity to um, get rid of the pause between spells. I'm Very handy if I can get it. Oh no, what did it just do? It did some sort of fireball and everyone got knocked back. Get back on him, Cart! No, Cart, what the hell? Can you obey me, you bastards? What Stop having do? a will of your own. I command here. Although you can go on him. You keep running. That's good. You aren't doing nothing. What the hell? Happy to help. 
Nira, did you get your alacrity off? You did not. You tried to do a bolt of glory on him. He's badly injured. What do you Bell and Rasad, do your greater whirlwind. What do you wish? Serva, greater whirlwind. Yeah. Cart. Hmm. To pierce shield. Because why the heck not? Lower his resistance some more. And then go for him. Come on, Cart. And everyone. Serbok is ba badly injured. You try to do something about that. Uh, where did he go? Serbok, there. Try to do a um, AoE heal in here. Give me some. That might be good. You. Go on him. He's badly injured. He's near death. I'm ready. You go. Ustanza dost. Kill him. Where did he go? He went invisible. Everyone go for this monk. Take him down. While we wait for him to come back. All oh, the the diva can see him. That's great. Card, are you back? No, you're not. Show me. Everyone, be prepared. Besides the diva. He's back. And he teleported. Get down! Get him! Feel my unholy wrath. Come on, you can do it. He seems to be um, panicking. Right. Come on, whirlwind attack! Yes, we got him. Great. I am done. Gamas, I need my brother. I will see you soon. The greatest of the ball spawn, the five have been destroyed, Godchild. Nearly all of Ball's essence has been returned to the source. Your journey is nearly complete. But the five aren't destroyed. Melisan remains. The one you know as Melisan is not a member of the five, Godchild. She is no child of Ball. Yeah, I know that, but she's involved. The dead god Ball has not been resurrected. You must understand what awaits you at the end of your journey, Godchild. And for this, the one you know as Melisan will explain for herself. Interesting. Give I'm me your story. Quickly. You are here at my sufferance, spirit. You will answer our questions. I am no dead thing. You have called a piece of a living goddess to you. However you have done it, should I become aware of what you have done, you will pay dearly. What do you mean, living goddess? You are no goddess yet, mortal. The prophecy has not come to fruition. It will soon enough. Everything has happened as I wished it, and this will be no different. All of Ball's essence will be mine! Then explain yourself. If you are correct, it shall make no difference in the end. True enough. So be it. My name is Amelison the Black-Hearted, High Matriarch and Greatest Deathstalker of my Lord Murder's Ballist Temple. Twas I who led all the chants in his holy name. Holy shit! Twas I who harbored his avatar when the Lord of Murder was cast down to walk among us in the time of troubles. To his greatest priestess did he come for succor. To my most trusted Deathstalker did I entrust the secrets of my resurrection. One of his priesthood needed to have access to the essence that would be collected from the ball spawn. One of his priesthood would have to perform the necessary rites to give the dead Lord of Murder back that essence. And so, Great Lord Baal entrusted that duty to me. After his death, I alone retained access to his essence, and my power grew as each one of his mortal children died, their divinity returning to the source. And so you have betrayed me, Amelison the Blackhearted. The time draws nigh, and yet you perform no rites! That is correct. Remain dust, my foolish god. Sick burn! So she's betrayed him. I who created the five, loosed the gods spawn at each other's throats all the while, promising those fools that they would serve at Ball's right hand. Well, they can, in limbo for all I care. Do you seek to become the new Lord of Murder? 
It was I who masqueraded as the protector of Ball Spawn, herding the ones that the five could not find to their doom. I led the last Ball Spawns to Serendush and had them slaughtered! But you couldn't have known that I would be there. No, that's true. I knew that Illocera would perish against your might, but I did not expect you to show up quite so soon. Still, you proved a fortunate arrival. Getting rid of one of the five without it looking like my doing was one thing. Hmm, but with you already in Saradush, I could turn you on Yagashura as well. After I let him into Saradush to kill the other Ballspawn, of course. You did it, you bastard! And then you turned on the rest of those paranoid fools while I distracted them. The five were the last thing I had to deal with before I could become the Lady of Murder myself. And you've dealt with them nicely. I'll stop you, Melisan. You won't get away with this. I have most of the essence of Ball under my control, fool. I am nearly a goddess. I control the entire abyssal realm that was once Baal's, all of the Throne of Blood. Do you dare come and face me there? Or shall I have to hunt you down like the sorry dog that you are? I'd confront your kind of evil wherever I had to go, and I will win. Then why wait? Let's see how the prophecy ends right here and now. But you're just a spirit, aren't you? But I guess we'll do it. Enough. A battle here will solve nothing. Aha! Your course is set, Godchild. Return to your pocket plane, and when you are ready, you will need to end its existence. Then you will be within the throne of blood, and Melisan will be at hand. She is not yet done taking the essence of Ball's children. I suggest that you move quickly, Godchild. The final act of the prophecy awaits. So we have one more final trial, and then we are going to confront Melisan. And I think that's the final boss, maybe. Interesting.